All right, this is a quick demo of the new preview generation capabilities of Polydex. So first, this is the old version. If you pointed to a folder on your computer that didn't have any preview maps in it, when you look at the grid, all you could see was the color map, which obviously isn't that useful. But now, if I open the new version, 0.1, still a beta, this is available for free during the beta, I get it from the link in the description. Now, if I point to a folder that I know for sure doesn't have any previews in it, let's open this, and you can see now, wait for it, ta-da! it is automatically going through the folder and it's generating previews for you. So it's looking at the contents of it and it's able to read it and yeah, generate a preview on the fly. And interestingly, these maps are actionable whilst they're generating. So if you're pointing to a folder that's just got hundreds and hundreds of assets in it and it's gonna take minutes to go through it, you can still work, you can still look around, you can still import things whilst it's doing, you don't have to worry about it. So as always, we are reading the folder and we are intelligently understanding what the color maps are, displacements, normal maps, reflection maps, all that kind of stuff. And then that is what is defined as an asset. And then we're generating a preview for it. The only thing that is not included in the previews is the displacement map. So it is using the normal map for that. But everything else, like even the opacity, uh, even transmission, it's working for glass as well. And you can see it is extremely fast. For now, this is textures only, but preview generation support is coming crucially for models. So stay tuned for that. And also in a, a very soon release in the next month or so, um, you will have the ability to filter. So you'll be able to choose like filter by uh, extension or filter by like asset type, like texture, HDR or something like that. So something a lot of people have been waiting for, but we are interested in your feedback. So if you try this out and there's something you don't like, or you got a question or anything like that, um, just reach out to Polygon however you want, uh, contact us or even on Twitter, um, we are all ears. So um, hope you like it and thank you for watching.